I love this guitar. Uh, hello, welcome. Uh, I'm here with my friend Quentin King. This is Paul at Music Villa. And this guitar is really cool. So thank you for being here. Uh, me and Quentin go back. We uh, play in a band together, and uh, he's a wonderful demonstrator of guitars. This one in particular, this one can be tricky for people. Uh, a lot of people don't really know what to do with this guitar. So what this is, it's a Style 5 Martin Custom Shop. This is one of our customs. We did an entire run with this special SIPO wood, and we did every body shape there is. And we really are proud of this guitar because it looks really cool. It's got the aged relic tuners, the Ivoroid inlaid Martin logo, uh, Ivoroid binding, and the um, beautiful top, the Ditson toner top. So this was a run of guitars that we did. Now this one is a little different. This is called a Style 5 Turs. So Turs, I believe, is means three in German. Uh, and what wh why that's like that is because this is actually tuned up a third. Um, got a whole different sound, whole different feel. I believe this was probably one of the first guitars they ever made. It was all the guitars back in the day were this size, and then they eventually got a little bit bigger. Very cool guitar, the smallest guitar Martin makes, and uh, this is one of our custom shop guitars. Let's dive right in. Play what you feel this guitar needs to be played. <laughs> Uh, when it, of course it makes my hands look huge which I, I like <laughs> uh, in a guitar but uh, obviously it's a it's a petite instrument and it and it makes you want to play with it with a with a delicacy that you wouldn't if you were playing a larger uh, dreadnought and and I think that really translates well into um, in, an instrument that is going to be conducive to intimate settings yeah um, the couch the you're couch sit on this the couch is with this you're going to just you're going to just do different things cuz it's tuned different and it just sounds so it, different. It has an angelic sound in, to my ear. It's it's very high and 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 belly. Yeah. Uh, but what I really like about this guitar other than the playability because it's you know of course very um, small and your hands yeah. can maneuver quickly um, is is just that it it really does feel like a timepiece that that you know I could be uh, yeah. in the late 1800s sitting exactly. around in a parlor somewhere. This one, even though it's small, what I love about it is it's, it doesn't sound like a, there's a lot of baby guitars out there, kids guitars. This one is a tiny little guitar, but it sounds like the real deal. I it mean, does. It has a real. full bodied tone for, for, you know, the petite body that it has. And again, uh, like so many of the, the fantastic guitars you have here, this one feels like it just wants to project. It wants to perform uh, and it wants to respond to whatever my fingers ask it to do, whether it's a quiet, soft, delicate sound or, or a dig into the string. You know, it's almost Christmas time and I feel like this guitar could probably use a Christmas song. say anything and this guy will play it he's just like a he's got like a library up here oh it's it's a corrupted library <laughs> my library is corrupted um but I just, going back to this guitar this this is the type of instrument that a lot of people would mistake because it's um has again a petite body that they would underestimate the value of a yeah uh, of a performance instrument like this that would really come in speaking of performance instrument i've seen sting play these live i see he has a model and uh you know, he does amazing stuff with it, so. Exactly. See, anything I name, he'll play it. Beautiful. 
Quentin King, Music Villa Custom Model. Uh, thank you for watching, and we will see you soon. Thank mm -hmm. you.